Hey guys, <laughs> I just took a quick break from my work and stuff. So, I can tell you uh, that I saw Watchmen this weekend, and uh, I basically have to go in with the sheep of people who have already read Watchmen and then went to see the movie. Um, basically, their consensus, and mine as well, was it was alright. Um, it's missing a lot of the depth that the book has which is understandable considering it's like 12 comics just kind of squished into one and um, it's I don't know a, a lot of people are gonna walk out of there confused or if you go in there expecting a superhero movie just it's not a superhero movie it has superheroes in it but and there's a bit of like fighting and action but that's just to just to like add some pacing to the story because otherwise it'd just be talking straight through. Um, basically what Watchmen is is a psychological uh, well it's really like the most intense character study in comic books like uh, the writer Alan Moore basically took a whole bunch of ideologies and made characters out of each one of them like uh, uh, Silk Spectre, one is exhibition is an exhibitionist. Uh, Rorschach's an objectivist. Um, Ozymandias is a utilitarian. Uh, John is a determinist. Night Owl is a idealist. And you just you can just see that if you look into the characters a bit. And then Night Owl is also a study on uh, masculinity. Rorschach's a study on absolutes. And then the whole comic book and movie have a whole bunch of gray areas. Yeah, it's it's very complex. It's very uh, interesting, in my opinion. Um, the comic book is basically regarded as like the greatest graphic novel ever um, by mostly everybody who has read it, um, and that's debatable. Uh, there's a lot of there's a couple comic books that are in that league, but um, Watchmen is certainly deserving of it. Um, also, I had completely lost what I was going to say. Anyway, the movie is good, um, but I prefer the comic book, and I'm sure you'll hear that from everybody. Um, yeah, so the theme for this week is to do a scene from a movie, so I decided to do a scene from Watchmen, because, um, I don't know, it's, it's my favorite book and it's supposed to be your favorite movie and I just kinda it works sort of it's not my favorite movie but it, it, it was entertaining I got shivers uh, when I saw some of the scenes come to life it was just like whoa um, and I had some good laughs at some like little inside jokes me and my brother have um, but yeah uh, so here's the scene uh, I modified my voice because I can't really do the voice properly. And then I edited it with the audacity and everything. Anyway, um, here you go, and have a good week. In the cemetery, all the white crosses stood rows, neat chalk marks on a giant scoreboard. Pit last respects quietly, without fuss. Edward Morgan Blake, born 1924, 45 years a comedian, died 1985, buried in the rain. Is that what happens to us? A life of conflict with no time for friends? So that when it's done, only our enemies leave roses? Violent lives ending violently. Dollar Bill, the silhouette, Captain Metropolis. We never die in bed. Not allowed. Something in our personalities, perhaps. Some animal urge, this fight and struggle making us what we are. Unimportant what we have to do. Others bury their heads between the swollen teats of injustice and gratification. Piglets squirming beneath the sow for shelter. But there is no shelter, and the future is bearing down like an express train. Blake understood, treated it like a joke, but he understood. He saw the cracks in society, saw the little man in masks trying to hold it together. He saw the true face of the 20th century and chose to become a reflection, a parody of it. No one else
all saw the joke. That's why he was wrong. Great joke once. Man goes to the doctor, says he's depressed, says life seems harsh and cruel, says he feels all alone in a threatening world where what lies ahead is vague and uncertain. Doctor says, treatment is simple. Great clown Pagliacchi is in town. Go and see him, that should pick you up. Man bursts into tears. Says, but doctor, I am Pagliacchi. Good joke. Everybody laugh. Roll on snare drum. Good.